Hi Sagittarius. This is a peek at your partner for the week of August the 14th through August the 20th, 2022. Universal energies. Show me what I need to see for the partner of the star sign of Sagittarius for August the 14th through August the 20th, 2022. Universal energies, show me what I need to see for the partner of the star sign of Sagittarius for August the 14th through August the 20th, 2022. Universal energies, show me what I need to see for the partner of the star sign of Sagittarius for August the 14th through August the 20th. 2022 show me you guys subscribe like comment and share these videos if this does not resonate with you check your moon rising and venus sign videos i do not read reversals so sagittarius Sag, this is a peek at your partner. So, Sag, your partner has the Ace of Pentacles. Your partner has the Five of Pentacles. Your partner has the Chariot. Your partner has Justice. And your partner has the Knight of Cups. So, Sag, your partner has the Ace of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. This is a brand new opportunity of something more solid, stable, and secure coming into your partner. Now, this can be an offer for an invite out for dinner and a movie. This can be about making things more committed. This can be about a lump sum of money, a job offer, a raise, a promotion, a bonus, a high ticket item purchase, a new home, a new car, a token of love, a gift, anything of value. Brand new practical beginning here. So Sag, some type of opportunity of practicality, money, assets, resources, property, accepting a gift, giving a gift, going out on a date, or a commitment here. Clarify the Ace of Pentacles for Sagittarius's partner. Clarify the Ace of Pentacles for Sagittarius's partner. Clarify the Ace of Pentacles for Sagittarius's partner. It is clarified with the Page of Cups. Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces. This is news or a message about a solid, stable, committed offer. Now this can, I'm sorry, this is the news or a message about a deep emotional connection. These are love messages or news of love. But this could also be the news about what love produced because there's a fish in this cup. So love messages and an apology. So your partner could be sending out love messages and an apology. They could be receiving love messages and an apology. Very well could be that we found love messages and heard the news of someone sharing love or some news about what love produced because pages are children and there's a fish in this cup. Clarify the page of cups for Sagittarius's partner. Clarify the page of cups for Sagittarius's partner. Clarify the page of cups for Sagittarius's partner. It is clarified with the five of swords. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. This is tit for tat, tug of war, one up in one another, snide remarks, having the last say, speaking ill of one another behind each other's back, backstabbing one another. This is playing mind games, ego tripping, trying to win at all costs, a bunch of mind games and manipulation. So Sag, listen, you know, your partner could tell me that you guys had this tit for tat, tug of war, toe to toe going on. Could have been some form of mind games and manipulation. However, your partner could be pissing. They may have an ax to grind. So Sag, listen, did you guys have this tit for tat, tug of war, toe to toe going on over some type of maybe money, assets, resources, property, and someone is wanting to apologize? But listen, listen, listen. <sighs> I hope that your partner is not trying to come in with some type of apology or romantic news because of mind games and manipulation. They may be trying to manipulate a situation to get something here, Sag. 
Sag, your partner has a five of pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. This is your partner feeling neglected, abandoned, excluded, left out in the cold. This can speak to financial lack and poverty consciousness. This could be a breakup. So Sag, listen, your partner could tell me that they're going through something financially, maybe some type of financial lack. However, this could be a breakup. Clarify the five of pentacles for Sagittarius's partner. Clarify the five of pentacles for Sagittarius's partner. Clarify the five of pentacles for Sagittarius's partner. It is clarified with the five of wands. Aries, Leo, or Sag. This is conflict. This is fussing, fighting, disagreements, arguments, jealousy, competition, drama. But this can also speak to your partner being conflicted within about something. So Sag, listen, your partner very well could be conflicted within about something. However, your partner could tell me that you guys had this disagreement, this argument, this drama taking place. And it could be over the coins, over money here. You know, however, your partner could tell me that, you know, yes, this conflict caused a breakup. Your partner could tell me that they're conflicted within because you guys broke up. But I just would be wary about them coming back. Sag, listen, your partner has the chariots. Could be dealing with a cancer, but your partner is determined to move forward confidently, victoriously, successfully ahead. Now, this can speak to travel. This can speak to relocating cities, states, countries. This can speak to moving from one residence to another or simply moving forward and leaving things behind. But your partner is determined to move forward confidently. So listen, Sag, could be dealing with a cancer, but your partner is wanting to make a move here. Clarify the chariot for Sagittarius partner clarify the chariot for Sagittarius's partner clarify the chariot for Sagittarius's partner it is clarified with the page of wands Aries Leo or Sag this is news or a message about a passionate creative new endeavor now this can be the news about the spark of a new idea the news a message about some type of passionate action that needs to take place but this one is symbolic of the male phallic and using the male phallic to be intimate so passionate messages or news of passion so Sag listen your partner could tell me that they're receiving passionate messages they could be sending out passionate messages very well could be that we found passion messages and heard the news of someone sharing passion or this is a heated discussion or argument clarify the page of wands for Sagittarius's partner clarify the page of wands for Sagittarius's partner clarify the page of wands for Sagittarius's partner it is clarified with judgment now judgment could be your partner passing their own final verdict and judgment over you guys as relationship Judgment could be the final verdict and judgment in a legal court case. But judgment is forgiveness and resurrection of the relationship. Second chances. So Sag, listen, your partner could be passing their own final verdict and judgment here. Someone could be asking for forgiveness and a second chance. Or we're dealing with something illegal. Clarify judgment for Sagittarius's partner. Clarify judgment for Sagittarius's partner. Clarify judgment. For Sagittarius's partner. It is clarified with the Eight of Cups. Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces. This is walking away from people, places, and things that no longer serve them. This is your partner detaching emotionally, feeling emotionally drained, and just walking away from people, places, and things that no longer serve them. So Sag, listen, your partner could tell me that they're walking away, detaching emotionally. But when we're dealing with the Eight of Cups, this is someone who's leaving in search of their Nine of Cups, their wish fulfillment. And oftentimes they find that the grass is not greener on the other side, so they end up returning. So Sag, listen, your partner could be walking away because you guys had this passionate communication, a heated discussion, an argument. Yes. However, your partner could tell me that they want to return here and ask for forgiveness and a second chance after some type of argument. But is there an alternative, alternative motive here? Sag, your partner has justice. Could be dealing with a Libra. But your partner may be calling for karmic justice. Saying, you know what? I'm a good person. I put good out there. I'm just expecting that good to return to me. Or your partner saying someone did me so wrong and so dirty. I'm calling for karmic justice. I want them to get exactly what they deserve. Or your partner's dealing with something in the justice system. So, Sag, could be dealing with a Libra, but your partner could tell me, hey, something isn't fair, something isn't balanced, something isn't just. 
Your partner can tell me that someone wants to come in and right a wrong and bring justice to a situation, or we're dealing with something in the justice system. Clarify justice for Sagittarius' partner. Clarify justice for Sagittarius' partner. Clarify justice for Sagittarius' partner. It is clarified with the Knight of Swords. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. This is someone rushing into your partner or your partner rushing in. Demanding truth. Demanding clarity. Speaking their truth. Spewing facts with direct, harsh communication. Now here's where truth comes out. It's swift, it's bitter, it's harsh, it's direct, it's almost confrontational. It's where you can't get a word in edgewise, but it's truth. So sad, some type of confrontation happening here. Question and answer session. Someone setting the record straight, someone getting to the bottom of something here. Clarify the Knight of Swords for Sagittarius's partner. Clarify the Knight of Swords for Sagittarius's partner. Clarify the Knight of Swords for Sagittarius's partner. It is clarified with the Queen of Swords, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. This queen is a no-nonsense type of queen. She already knows the truth. She'll let you speak your truth to bring more clarity, but she has no problems with cutting people, places, and things out of her life that no longer serve her. So Sag could be dealing with Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, or someone with air prominent in their chart. However, your partner could be taking on the energy of this Queen of Swords and cutting something out. But also with the Queen of Swords, this can be legal documentation or paperwork. Clarify the Queen of Swords for Sagittarius' partner. Clarify the Queen of Swords for Sagittarius' partner. Clarify the Queen of Swords for Sagittarius' partner. It is clarified with the Two of Cups. Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces. This is, we see eye to eye, face to face. We are spiritually connected. We are one. We are meant to be. We are soulmates. Soulmates with a divine union, a divine connection. So, Sag, listen, your partner sees you as their soulmate here, but there's a confrontation taking place here. Some type of argument taking place here and a cutting off and a walking away because your partner may be feeling like something isn't fair, something isn't balanced, something isn't just. However, Sag, did you guys have some type of agreement here? <clears throat> and is there threats about filing legal documentation or paperwork in the justice system here, Sag? Is this over coins? And for some of you guys, it can be support for children. Sag, your partner has the Knight of Cups, Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces. This is someone coming into your partner or your partner coming in to apologize, to offer their cup of love and make the romantic gesture. So someone is saying, I'm sorry. Someone is trying to heal things, mend things, work things out. Maybe be coming in with a romantic gesture here. Clarify the Knight of Cups for Sagittarius's partner. Clarify the Knight of Cups for Sagittarius's partner. Clarify the Knight of Cups for Sagittarius' partner. It is clarified with the King of Cups, Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces. This king is a very loving, kind, compassionate king. He's fair and balanced in his emotions, but he does not wear his emotions on his sleeve. He's in complete control of his emotions. So Sag could be dealing with Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces, or someone with water prominent in their charts. However, your partner could be taking on the energy of this King of Cups. Now, the King of Cups is someone with a great deal of emotions within them, but they're not outwardly expressing their emotions. They're masking their emotions or wearing a mask. Also with the King of Cups, this is a nurturing father figure, so you could be dealing with the parent of your child here. Clarify the King of Cups for Sagittarius' partner. Clarify the King of Cups for Sagittarius's partner. Clarify the King of Cups for Sagittarius's partner. It is clarified with the King of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. This king is usually stable, rooted, grounded, traditional, believes in the institution of marriage and family, someone who is good with managing finances and material resources. This could be a business owner, CEO, independent contractor, manager. So Sag could be dealing with Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, or someone with Earth prominent in their charts. However, when we're dealing with the King of Pentacles, the King of Pentacles is a married, stable, committed person, so you could be dealing with a spouse. King of Pentacles is a nurturing father figure, so you could be dealing with the parent of your child. 
Could be dealing with someone you work with or do business with or have some type of joint assets, resources, and property with. Or a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Clarify the King of Pentacles for Sagittarius' partner. Clarify the King of Pentacles for Sagittarius' partner. Clarify the King of Pentacles for Sagittarius' partner. It is clarified with the Nine of Swords. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. This is your partner being anxious, worried, stressed. Replaying things over and over in their mind. Losing sleep at night. Worried about something. So, Sag, listen. Your partner's all up in their head. Stressed, worried, anxious, can't eat, can't sleep. Bothered by something here, Sag. Now, Sag, yes, it very well could be that you're coming in to apologize to them and they're all up in their head about it. And you guys are going back and forth because someone still has unanswered questions. However, Sag, listen. I feel like your partner is anxious here. I feel like they're worried and they're anxious. And I feel like they want to come in with some type of apology or romantic gesture, Sag. But it's out of mind games and manipulation. I feel like they're wanting to return, ask for forgiveness and a second chance. Because they're trying to get something here, Sag. I feel like you guys had some type of argument over coins or something like that. That caused the breakup. But I feel like they're coming back. But in a slick type of way, Sag. I would be careful. They have an agenda. Sag, this is a peek at your partner for the week of August the 14th through August the 20th, 2022. You guys, give me feedback. Subscribe, like, comment, and share. And I'll see you guys next week. Peace.